Faro are known for metrology, but it's not just metrology. Tell me about some of the products you've got on your stand, please. Oh, yeah, so we've got the Faro Tracer here. So this is our laser projector. So it projects wireframe CAD model onto components. So it can be ceiling mounted and it will give you a 15 by 15 meter window if you're 15 meters away. If you're three meters away, it'll give you three meters by three meters. You can see it moving around here, so it's showing you your different areas on there. So it can be used for positioning components, and it's also typically used within the composites industry, so anyone from marine, motorsport, aerospace, uh, and they'll have it so that they can look at the layup, and they'll have it over the layup to enable the operators to, to work a lot easier. Okay, now these are normally aimed at sort of your bigger OEMs almost, but now it's bringing it more to the machine shop. Yes, yeah, yeah, so using the machine shop as well, so it helps eliminate a lot of jigs and fixtures, and a lot of costs with that, and it means you can just change the, the, the CAD very quickly, upload new CAD rather than have to uh, change your, your jigs and fixtures. Okay, and huge work in Envo, 15 by 15? Yes, that's right, yeah, yeah. So what sort of accuracy though? Uh, so you're looking about quarter of a mil accuracy on that laser there. Okay, now next product, measurement arm. Yes, yeah, yeah, so we're, we're well known for the, the Faro arms. This is the Quantum S Max. This is our latest version. So it's uh, the full scan system, 38 microns accuracy. And we've got the probing on there as well, single point accuracy, about 20 microns. So easy to use, he's holding his microphone at the same time. So this is our, you can see it's got internal counterbalance, so I don't need to worry about it, so I can use it with just one arm. And uh, it, so if, health and safety conscious as well then? Exactly that, exactly that. Uh, for probing, very nice and easy, easy to use software, so I don't have to tell the software what I'm doing. I can start probing, you see there are three points, it's giving me a plane four points, I've got a form error on there as well. And if I just wanted to start measuring circles, again, I'm not telling the software anything I'm doing. And as I'm going around, it's sort of creating our objects on there. So we can see now we've got a cylinder there and I can sort of move around and just build up objects. Couldn't be simpler, but this is seven axis, but moving up to eight axis. Yeah, so this is seven axis. We've got our laser on the top there. So that enables us to have our, our laser on the top. The eighth axis here, as you say, <clears throat> It's got encoders the same as the arm, so we register the two together, and then it means I can move the table rather than have to move the arm. So you can see as I'm moving the table around there, I'm measuring on here, so I've now got a plane on there, and now I'll use that plane as my clipping plane. So I'm gonna scan that component, but rather than having to remove that table afterwards, the software will remove that for me. So Again, so you've got some intuitive software going on here. Yes, very, very clever software. What nice size components can you put on here? So this will actually take up to 100 kilos in weight. Um, so this is our small plate on there, we do a larger so 500 mil plate and we can put car doors on here. And you can see when I'm scanning... How quick and easy is that? That's exactly what you want to machine. Just to reiterate, what sort of accuracy is this going to? So that's 38 microns and that will capture 1.2 million points per second. Right, Peter, great love of those two products. Now I'm going to hand you over to Rowan, who's busy in conversation. We're going to have to interrupt him and we'll find out more about some more products on the Faro stand. Makes your life easier, oh, right? Here we go, gentlemen. Over to Rowan. Hello. Tell us more. Yeah, thank you very much, Colin. So I'm here with Paul from Faro. Now we're going to be talking about this Faro tracking laser. Yeah. Now, what, what is this? How does it work? Shall I take that uh, microphone yeah. off you? There you go. So you oh, go explain how it works. Cheers. So yeah, Rowan, this uh, Vance G6, basically for large scale metrology, uh, planes, trains, automobiles. Um, we can align anything from wings, back doors, rail sections. Uh, so yeah, large scale metrology over a period of uh, 35 meters or 80 meters, whichever you want to go. Each has got a little different inaccuracy um, it, over the distance you go. But um, yeah, this is uh, an SMR. Uh, the SMR will, laser tracker will follow the SMR and I can then go around the plane or train or automobile and align the wing in the right orientation, right position. And as it's a, light, a line of sight uh, product, if I lose the line of sight because I need to measure a back face, I can, the six probe comes into play. I can basically marry up the six probe with my, my laser tracker. You'll see here, it will lock on. And then now it's going to follow my six probe. So what I can do, it's going to lose the signal, but I can turn around and if my, my face is here and I want to measure the back end of the face, I've still got the line of sight so we can measure the flange face. So we have no obstructions on site at all. Accuracy over about 10 meters uh, is probably around 90 microns, maybe just a tiny little bit Which less. Which really quite accurate for Very such a accurate like 10 meters indeed. a long way. Yeah, we have a lot of customers that use these for a lot of aerospace applications. Yeah. Can um, you mind grabbing this microphone? Can I have a no. quick go with that little sphere? Yeah, okay. absolutely. Let me, uh, let me get We've out of my pocket for you. No, this, so so you'd be, people will be using this to measure wing orientations when they're trying to put yeah, wings on. Yeah, when we're trying to align back doors of military planes and stuff. You know, how do we know we've got it right? In, in that aperture, it's got to be right, you know. And this is the way uh, 
a, a fundamental way to, to be getting it right. right so, so there you if go. You, if you put your microphone up to your mouth again, yes, sorry. Let me uh, oh, try and find it. So people also use these to align robots to each other as well. So it's yeah, not well, just aerospace assembly. Exactly. Well, the robots, you know, they do have their, their robot teach pendants where they can tell them where they are. Uh, but if you've got a room where you've got 10,000 robots, how does that one robot know where that tooling is and yeah. vice versa? So we'll align into the tooling and we'll tell and teach the robot where that particular tool is. Yeah. This is like the complete opposite of a machine probing system and a machine tool. And I absolutely love it. The yeah, tolerance please, is amazing. Have, well, have a go. Thank you very much. And uh, yeah, so I think this is just the coolest thing I've seen today. So far, at least, anyway. So well, I, I'm pleased to have I mean, I'm sure, room. Thank you. So I'm sure the aerospace guys already know this, the, uh, guys and girls already know that this exists. So, I mean, maybe there's not many people who don't know these exist if they need them. But if anyone's interested in, in measuring a big fat wing sticking into a fuselage, yeah, then maybe you should get in touch with Give Farrow. us a shout, yeah. This is why we come to shows like this, to educate people that haven't seen this technology. And uh, yeah, it's, it's brilliant. This is the coolest thing. Thank you very much, no, Paul. Thank you, Rowan. Take care.